Hello. Today's video is about five different ways that you can start your YouTube videos and not have to show your face. Now, that's not the way to do it. You're not going to talk and hide your face, obviously, and you're not going to put a bag over your head, but there are ways that you can have a successful channel, successful YouTube videos that rank and never show your face. Now I'm showing my face now, but I'm going to show you five different ways that you can make videos and not have to show your face. If that's something that's intimidating to you, many people, the number one thing holding them back from starting their channel is the fact that they don't want to get one there themselves. They're very intimidated. They're afraid of what everybody will think. And to be honest, we all start that way. I made my very, very first live video on Facebook. It's been probably three or four years ago. And I was like, hyperventilating before I did it. I, I even had to go drink a shot of whiskey to be honest, to calm me down. But once I did it, it was like, nobody cared. Like nobody made comments. It was more natural comments like, Oh, thanks for the information, things like that. But nobody said, what the hell are you doing? You know, who do you think you are? Anything like that, or you need to do this or you need to do that. It, it just happened. And from there on, it was a piece of cake. Now, did I make mistakes on my early ones? Am I making mistakes today? Absolutely. But that's what learning and growing is all about. So to help you get started, if that's intimidating to you and it's really holding you back, then start making videos using one of these five different ways. Okay, let's get started. Now, the first one that I'm showing you is called screen share. And this is how I do most of my videos. I pull my information up or my examples up from my laptop and then I do a screen share. And with screen share, you can opt in to have your camera on or you can have it off now for the rest of this video i have my camera off because i want to show you how you can listen to my voice not have to see me down there in the corner and you can still learn now i found a video where somebody made um, an example of how to use excel how to make a line graph in excel that you know how to videos are phenomenal if you're just getting started i highly recommend just start making how to videos eventually you'll start getting um, deeper into your content and your niche and what you're doing and that will become second nature but to get over that fear of even making a video how-to videos without your face are a great way to start i do recommend eventually you show yourself but until you get over that hump just start making videos without showing your face so here's one i have the sound turned off so it's going to be running um and it's how to make a line graph Again, you can see the person has their little pointer and things like that. Now, the the per, the video editor that I use to make my videos is called Camtasia. I have the link below. And in my video editor, see how he's pointing to things? I have the ability to highlight that, hi, that pointer so that people can kind of follow easier. There's all kinds of different trips, ticks, trips and all kinds of different things that you can add to kind of highlight it okay so there's your first way is doing using screen share let's look at the second way this one here is you can use a slideshow so you could set up some pictures in a powerpoint and turn it into a slideshow you can put some music in the background this is a friend of mine that has a channel and she's highlighting her uh, little puppies and things she runs a breeding uh, comp uh, business and she wanted to start a youtube channel so what she does is she just shows the growth of her puppies and this is one of the videos that she made she just took pictures of them they weren't moving around yet so it was easier just to kind of do a slideshow and it's been very successful but you could do that with anything if you have um maybe you do graphic design or something and you just want to show some of your examples of what you do you could show those on a slideshow or you know, maybe you have a home video where you're just highlighting your kids and what they do, you can show some photos. So that is a great way. Um, put some neat music in the background. People love that stuff. The next one, the way that you can show the third way, show a video and not show your face is with product reviews. So you might want to start the video out by just talking about what's coming up and then just kind of run it like a commercial. This particular one is the best DSLR cameras in 2019. The person that made the video did pop one in the beginning and said, now you're going to see some of the best cameras, the six best cameras. But here they're just showing examples and you can hear their voice in the background talking about them. What are the features and things like that? Especially if you're getting into my niche, which is affiliate marketing, and you're afraid to show yourself on camera, then use your voice and show the pictures and talk about the features 
pictures. But this is very entertaining. You don't have to have your picture down in, in the corner there. So there you go. They're showing to six different products. And I'm sure if you scroll below, you'll see all the affiliate links where people who are watching can go ahead and buy those products and you get to make a commission. So if you're definitely here because you want to start an affiliate marketing business, this is a great way to start. And you don't have to be all upset and worried that you have to show your face on video. All right, let's look at the fourth one. This one I thought was fun. It's a how-to video on doing origami. <laughs> I hope I said that right. But this one, they're showing you with their hands and how to fold the paper, and you can see how to make origami shapes. Maybe you have a channel where you're doing art or music, you know, how to play a guitar, how to play a piano. You can just show the how-to part. Your hands obviously have to be in there. Or somebody else can be doing the actions, and you can be videotaping and talking about it. Or if your instructions are really, really clear with the video and you don't have to talk, you could even edit the, the um, video, have music playing in the background, and then just have words pop up. Step one, make sure you fold the paper. So you can use voice or you can use text either way. But I thought this was fun. Um, they're showing you how to do it. They're going really slow. And obviously this video I'm sure gets a lot. Yeah, it has over 2 million views. Um, people want to know how to do origami and it's easier to see how to do it. So how to videos, again, I'm telling you are phenomenal. They're a great way to get started and you can use them in any niche. All right, now we're going to do number five. This one's a little different, but you could do, let's say you have a campaign where you're trying to promote something in your business and you're really hyperventilating, you just don't even wanna talk. You can send your information to hire somebody on fiverr.com, I've got a link below, and they will make you a doodle video. So they'll take your information, they'll work with you, and then they'll make a doodle video. So if you don't even wanna talk and you want somebody else to, they can do the voiceover, they can do the um, doodle video, they can do the whole thing for you. Now again, I'm going to be upfront. Eventually, you need to use your own voice or you need to be seen because people buy from you, especially if you're doing a business, people will buy from you because they trust you and we're very visual and they want to get to know who you are. So eventually, I think you'll get over that hump. Now, if you're just doing fun how-to videos and you're creating a channel like the origami or something like that, you may get away with not showing your face. But if you're in business, I'm, I'm just going to give you that pointer that you eventually want to show yourself. So let's go ahead and click one of these. I think they give you an example here. Okay, here's an example. I pulled up a video where, see how they're doing the doodling and they talk and promote and the whole video is doodled for you. And like I said, you they will create it for your niche. Um, just go to that fiverr.com. When I was over there and I clicked in, they were just giving different examples of some of their artwork. So I, I got, went out to um, YouTube to find a an example of how it works. Okay, so those are five different ways that you can get on video and not show your face. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Um, I have lots of good content that I'll show you to help you in your business and help you get started. That's where my heart and my passion is. I want you to get over that fear of starting your business and just do it. And I'm trying to give you the tips and all the tricks and things to help you get started. Uh, tell me in the comments if there's any questions that you have or anything like that, and I will be happy to make a video to answer those. Um, all right, have a good afternoon or a good day, and I will see you on the next video.